Right. Now let's move on to a story we've been wanting to do for a while because it's something that is a very interesting question that gets answered. What do you get when you spend more money on something when you actually can get the entire same category for a much lower price? I'm talking about wireless earbuds. You know, they've become famous out there on our other show, The Gadget 360 Show. We're doing a twin review of Sony True Wireless Earbuds, so do watch that show too. Now today what we're going to do is we're going to take a Samsung earbud about 12,000 rupees and compare it to Redmi which is under 4,000 rupees. So what do you really do when you're spending 8,000 rupees more? Do you really get bang for buck when you spend that much more money? Remember, it's to do with sound, something we are all very, very sensitive to. Buds, easily the most trending term of this year. And rightly so, as every brand is taking out their best possible version of the true wireless earphones. Today we look at two options. One that focuses on audio quality and another that wants to give a premium experience at an affordable price. We will start with the Samsung Galaxy Buds Plus, which are the successor of the Galaxy Buds launched last year. The new Buds may look almost the same as its predecessor, but bring better performance and battery life on board. The sound quality is outstanding with powerful bass and right high notes. The audio is rich and natural and we thoroughly loved listening to the music on it. As it now comes with dual dynamic drivers. There is a 3 mic setup for loud and clear voice calls in any surrounding. The battery life steals the show as it offers up to 11 hours of non-stop music on a single charge. Of course, the case gives an additional charge. The big bummer is that no noise cancellation on board. The Buds Plus fit beautifully in the ear and look slightly better than last year's Buds. And our opinion has made the earphones look a bit better. The charging case comes with an indicator light at the front and USB Type-C port for charging at the back. The case can also be charged wirelessly through reverse charging on a smartphone that supports this or using a QI wireless charger. The Buds Plus act even smarter with the Buds Plus app with which, with which we can customize a lot of gestures. We highly recommend for those who are on Android and have 12,000 rupees of budget and can do without noise cancellation. Moving on from Buds that cost 12,000 to the Buds that cost 2,000 rupees. Meet the Xiaomi Redmi Buds S, super light, true wireless earphones that have decent audio quality and bring noise cancellation in under 2000 rupees. The discreet design is comfortable and being just 4G each, we could wear them for long hours. The pairing is super easy and it does have control in the earbuds to pause and play. The Redmi Earbuds S ship with a low latency mode for gamers that can be activated by pressing the button on the earphone thrice. They are IPX4 rated, which means they are sweat resistant, but don't go swimming with them. The audio quality is decent but not at par with the buds that cost 5 to 10 times more. Also the build quality is not that sophisticated. We like that Xiaomi has added noise cancellation and it works fairly well. The Redmi Buds S are priced at 1799 rupees in India. They are a great option for everyone who doesn't want to spend a lot, yet get everything 2020 buds have to offer. They are truly the buds for the masses.